Today I'm going to do a little bit of Robert McClellan for you. This is a piece from Sweet Largy Bay, which is a poem um, that was written for radio. It's kind of like a play, a radio play. And it's written in Lalin Scots, as all McClellan is. It's absolutely fabulous. The language is so rich. And I've been given permission to perform this by the McClellan family. So I do hope you enjoy it. I'm going to talk, this is Jeannie Speaks, and Jeannie is the neighbour's daughter. And... Uh, and way back in the days of your families were always called on to look at the boarding house. The women were always running about and doing everything for the guests. And it kind of reminds me of my own childhood being brought up in a small hotel. So um, I hope you enjoy it. And I should add that Jeannie fancies Johnny, who's the neighbour's son. And Johnny has got bigger ideas and bigger fish to fry. So, Jeannie speaks. With the green hawthorn came my mother's borders, and flitting my feet, I flit about the house. But in bain again, up and down again, in and doot and run about, making beds and soup and flares, shaking mats and rugs and carpets, dusting chairs and chests of drawers, serving at the borders' tables, breakfast, dinners, teas and suppers, scraping pats and pans and ashes, washing plates and cups and saucers, Drying plates and cups and saucers, putting plates and cups and saucers in their places, in the presses, sign out among the rooms again, bending and up and down again, filling all the rubber bottles, turning back the borders, bedspreads, setting tables for the morning, checking out the sorts and papers, laying fires and sifting cinders, till my feet are fat and fiery, and my head is like a peary, and I'm far or doffed and weary to be fashed by only fury, or the fickleness of Johnny, sitting all day by his jetty. Fidging fain for lazy limmers, lying shameless on the shore. <clears throat> and thanks to Johnny McLeal and the family for allowing me to do that. <laughs> 